have those in your head, you can just stay in your seat, lean over, whisper them to Paco, and then Paco's gonna run backstage and get what you asked for, okay? Think of two items. All right, you got it? All right, just whisper it to him. He's got big ears. You told him to? All right, Paco, you heard the man. Now, folks, this is not a trick. This is a trained behavior. He is running backstage, staying it through a huge pile of clothing, getting exactly what James has asked for. Let's see who he brings out for the first article of clothing. Oh, hi. It looks like he brought you a hat. Did you ask for a hat, yes or no? Yep. Great, we got the first one right. Good job, Paco Taco. Here's some snacks. All right, go get that second item. Now, once he gets your first one right, he never misses the second one. This is going to be a 100% show. I am so excited for him to bring out exactly what James is thinking about this afternoon. You think really hard about that article of clothing. Let's see, oh no. James, you asked for this? show. <laughs> Wipe that smile off your face. Stand up for me, bud. Give a nice big wave to all your Hollywood fans. Wait, where are you going, James? Take a bow. Beautiful. Sit. Good boy. There you go. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You're doing an excellent job. I'm going to keep you around for the next scene, okay? Okay, take a walk with me. Oftentimes on the movie says, our directors want our dogs to do things that they have probably never done before, like go over, around, or through something that they have never seen. It's our jobs as animal trainers to train them through that. We're going to demonstrate how with a friendly audition with two of your favorite animal stars. Come on. 